This is Dot Complicated on Business Radio. Here is your host, Randy Zuckerberg. Hello, I am Randy Zuckerberg, and I am so thrilled to be here with all of you today for Dot Complicated. I'm especially excited because this is my first time coming to you from the gorgeous studio at Wharton. I think having a channel like Business Radio is very important because technology especially is having such a huge impact on all business, society, how we live our lives. I think it's becoming increasingly important to stay up to date on all of those trends because they're affecting all of us no matter if you run a company, if you have employees, if you're looking to work at a company. These are issues that are affecting our day-to-day -day lives now. Welcome to Launchpad on Business Radio powered by the Wharton School. I'm Carl Ulrich. Vice Dean of Innovation at the Wharton School. And the I idea for Business Radio came out of a conversation between one of our alums, Mark Rowan, and the president of SiriusXM, Scott Greenstein. Business Radio is, is unique compared to other uh, financial and more stock-driven shows in the sense that it is really not worried about the market. The focus of Business Radio is how to be a better, more well-informed executive or entrepreneur or to learn from real life experiences you might not have had exposure to. A lot of the Wharton professors have practical experience, not just academic experience. And I thought that would be a great transition to the working force that could listen and learn and benefit from it. Not only should they just find a job, they should find a job that they that they like, that they really love, that they can. Well, we call it more than that. We call it your area of destiny. We, yeah. we urge people to get build their careers in a, at that intersection of what they're uniquely good at. Yeah. Okay, some people are good at a lot of things, but you are uniquely good at something yeah. and what you love to do. There's certainly a lot of media focused on business, but one of the exciting things about business radio is that we, from the Wharton perspective, can bring cutting edge knowledge about business, research about business, to the general listening public. When we first started, we thought it might be just faculty who would be hosting the radio shows. But what we've learned is that there's some great members of our community, staff, students, alumni, who can participate as well. And that's really enriched the kinds of programming that we have on the station. In other cases, we've brought in people from the outside business community who we just thought would be really interesting. So for instance, we have Randy Zuckerberg who hosts a show called Dot Complicated about how technology intersects with our daily lives. I talk to a lot of entrepreneurs who are using crowdfunding. I'm just so curious what you learned. I think partnering with Wharton is a brilliant move for SiriusXM because you have access to all of these bright, fresh minds and way of thinking. The business of tomorrow is not going to be created by people who have already been in industry for decades and decades. It's going to be created and disrupted by the new fresh thinkers. Wharton and the, the Wharton business programs, both undergraduate and graduate, look like the definitive name for practical business information that people could use. So rather than just the students getting the benefit of that, I thought there were a lot of executives that might benefit as well. Our number, if you'd like to join in the conversation, is 844-WHARTON. That's 844 -844 One of the key goals of the Wharton School is really to disseminate knowledge about business to the world at large. And Business Radio gives us an opportunity to reach millions of listeners very efficiently.